While these search operations are being carried out across the country, yesterday we saw an interesting statement being made by Minister Dr. Rajita Sena Ratna, where he accused Gotabe Rajapaksa of having connections with the now banned National Tawhid Jamaat organization. Today, the joint opposition convened another media briefing to respond to this allegation. <laughs> During a media briefing yesterday, Minister Raj Dasena Ratna added another lie to his collection of lies. He says that I have maintained close connections with the National Tawhid Jamaat organization. He showed a photo of me with the secretary of the National Tawhid Jamaat organization, Abdul Razak. This is a lie. Within the next week, I will send him a letter of demand claiming compensation of 500 million rupees, citing defamation. The NTJ organization published a singular translation of the Quran and they decided to gift me a copy. Therefore, I accepted it. Was it just me and Mahindra Rajpaksa who accepted these copies? According to photos circulating the internet, Minister Ravindra Samaravira, a member of this government, is also seen accepting a copy. Another photo shows Venerable Dambara Amilathera accepting a copy. Another photo shows Chairman of the Elections Commission, Mahindra Deshapriya, who has no political connection, accepting a copy of the Quran. The next photo will amuse you. Rajita Sena Ratna, who accuses me of associating a terrorist, is seen seated and talking with these terrorists in his office. If Abdul Razak is the general secretary of a terrorist organization. Abdul Razak can Rastavadi Samidani Mahale Kamna, Apita Chodana Karandakali, Etumayana Jati in Samara, Hamuda Baravit. Go to Abe Rajabak Samatma, Kisudu Antavadi Samidani. We challenge Minister Rajita Sena Ratna to prove that Gotabe Rajpaksa supported any of these extremist organizations. Minister Rajita also said that the salaries of 25 intelligence officers were also paid. What a low and disgraceful accusation. They also accuse Gotabe Rajapaksa of being involved in the murder of two police officers. We will take action against such accusations in the near future. This is a complete lie. <laughs>